start this problem by asking ourselves what forces are acting on the crate. As shown on this screen now, there's the force of gravity acting downwards, which is 50 G, and then there's the um, force of friction acting upwards along the slope. Notice that I've drawn a set of coordinates on the screen there. I've chosen the x direction to be parallel to the slope and the y direction to be perpendicular to the slope. I'm now going to resolve the weight vector into two components, one along the slope and one perpendicular to the slope. So along the slope we have 50 g sine 15 degrees and perpendicular to the slope we have 50 g cos 15 degrees. We're now in a position where we can draw our free body diagram, which is shown on the screen now, where I've also included now the normal reaction force, N, acting between the crate and the slope. Right, we're now ready to write down our equations of motion. We can write an equation of motion in the X direction first, the resultant force in the x direction, taking the positive direction as down the slope, is 50 g sine 15 minus the frictional force F subscript F.